welcome welcome everybody daily commitment where we do a little exercise every day and today we're doing some more stretching I did pull-ups yesterday I definitely felt a little bit of soreness still in this left arm so I did a lot of stretching on this left arm I've also done a lot of these stretches with my arms different things like this I'm telling you, man, I've been stretching for like 20 minutes, maybe 25 before I even started the video. I don't want to bore you guys with all the stretches I've been doing. I'm just, I got this cat just wants to jump on me right here. He's super cute. His name is Beanie. Anyway, guys, so the point is I'm just going to talk about some of the stretches I've been doing, show you a quick, I'm not going to do, the stretches take time because you have to get in your stretch position and then just kind of stretch it, give it time. Let's say you're doing this stretch right here. You don't just go, oh, we're done stretching. You go. You have to feel that stretch happen to that muscle. You have to feel it. Same thing, we're doing this. You have to give it time, you have to feel it stretch. And I'm about to kick this cat off of me and talk about some other stretches. The most important stretch I've been doing lately is this one for my inner adductor here, which is like this, and then you lean forward. You can feel that muscle stretch right there. That one's been awesome for me, so we've done some of those. But also we've done some of these yoga pose ones. So for instance, I'm gonna stay seated here for a second. Normally it's standing. Cactus pose right here, this is cactus pose, right? And it pulls your shoulder blades together back there and all that stuff. Uh, beanie, no, we're doing our video. Um, the, the number one, the, the one I started with when I started doing the stretching was the elephant walk, which is here, you just hang it, just hang it. If you like that, you're walking the elephant walk. As you can see here, we're getting some good stretch there. We're not quite palms all the way down. I'd like to get to that, but we're not quite there. We're close, we're close, we're close, but not quite. It's the elephant walk or the elephant stretch. Um, another really good one, of course, is downward facing dog, which I'm sure you've all heard of before. This one is awesome for the calves. I've been rocking that one for the calves and stuff. And you can segue that one, all, you can walk it all the way out. You can do the cobra pose here. You can feel that. Ah, oh, stretching everything. It's just awesome, man. I'm telling you, get yourself a good podcast or something. Turn it on. A good YouTube video that you don't have to look at. And just sit and stretch, man. Just play with your body. You don't even have to do any official yoga poses. Just, you know, lay down. Pull your leg up here. You can feel it, man. You can feel. Put your leg over here. You can feel it stretching. Just play with your body. Stick it in all these different poses, and you can feel yourself just feeling better, just healing, just absolutely healing. So why am I focusing so much on stretching today? Is because a I had that uh, pain here, and I didn't want to. I don't want to get in a cycle of pain, pushing the exercise pain, pushing the exercise pain. Also, the, uh, the adductor muscle was hurting a little bit after the squats yesterday, and again we only did 20 squats. That's a pretty, it's a pretty light squat day. So what we're going to do is we're going to do even lighter today, a ton of stretching and just a very, very little bit of exercise. That's right. We're not going to push the amount of exercise. So we're going to do push-ups today because today is push-up day. We're going to do push-ups, pull-ups, push-ups, pull-ups. We're going to do squats every day. So with our push-ups, uh, it's really important that we keep our shoulders square. When I was doing push-ups when I started, I would let them creep up like this. So I want that to be square. First of all, square here. Second of all, these guys come down. Elbows back, not pinned against the sides, but out just a little bit. Oh, I'm gonna do a push-up with a, with a beanie on, on top of me here. But anyway, I'm gonna do like two push-ups here, guys. You guys are gonna watch. We're gonna get really good form. We're tighten legs, tighten butt, tighten chest, everything. We're gonna come straight up. And we've been stretching. At the top of this, there's a stretch right here you're getting. Getting a stretch on that, on that guy. That's it, one push-up. That's it, guys, just one push-up. Today is stretch day, man. I'm telling you, I'm stretching everything. I'm stretching it, man. I'm stretching. We'll be back to push-ups again two days from now. So, yeah, I got no problem with this. Look, a little hip stretch here. The hip is, hip is well, you can't really see. The hip here, excuse me, kitty cat. There's a kitty cat. There's a kitty cat right here. Kitty cat. Um, but you can, when you lay this hip over, you're stretching your back out. I'm telling you, if you just take a day and say, you know what, I'm mostly just stretching today and just put your body in these different positions and stuff and just feel it, man, and take your time. You can't rush. Daily commitment was quick five, 10 minutes, quick five, 10 minutes. 
and then stop. And that's great. But if I'm going to advance and get past all these sore parts, I'm going to want to stretch, man. And stretching is healthy for you, man. Look at me rotate this arm around, rotating around. It's getting a full stretch here because the way I have my back, full stretch. It just feels great. And when you tell your body, I have time to stretch and I have time to recover, it de-stresses everything, man. It's awesome. So anyway, so elephant pose, uh, downward facing dog, uh, cobra pose, uh, push-ups, uh, tons of different leg stretches and arm stretches where we go all around the different range of motion, use the weight of it to do it. Um, I, th I think there's a name for this one where you go like this and then you can come down into the cactus pose. I'm telling you, I've been laying around, our carpets are getting clean today, so I got to move all the furniture out of here. And so it's just great to have all this carpet to move around in. Yeah, that's right, I did one freaking push-up. That's it, guys. That's it. And I think that was pretty good form on that one push-up. And I'm stretching, I want this arm to be healed, man. Now, when I do my walk today, I'm not gonna take the guitar, because I've had a little pain in this edge of the elbow. So there's two spots, here in the forearm, which hasn't been hurting me lately, but like I said, I did pull-ups yesterday, and all of a sudden I got a little pain here. So I wanna make sure we don't trigger that forearm muscle to start messing up again so full stretches on this forearm muscle today and then also I'm, I'm not going to take the guitar when I do my walk so I'm just going to get the exercise walk without all the guitar playing and that's going to make sure I don't tweak out this elbow here and I want to do pull-ups tomorrow and I want to feel great or wait no today was push-up day yeah tomorrow yeah every other day I want to do pull-ups more often man I want to get to this man I'm close man I'm close I'm telling you I was doing pull-ups every day for a little while before the injuries I think we can get back to that, man. I think we can get back to it. We've got the lower weight with the pull-ups because we've got those straps on there. They're not the ones with no, um, I think it's like 17 pounds I have off of there. Plus, I'm losing weight, man, down to 176.8 again. I know I was there before, then I messed up. We're going to get back down. We're going to get back down under 170. You guys are going to see. Anyway, let's do a couple squats. I'm just going to do a couple squats just like I did just a couple. I'm sorry, little kitty cat, but you have to move. Well, you just don't have to move. You're kind of on the floor if I can unwind my legs around you. With the squats, oh, I forgot, that's another stretch I did. I just sat here like this. I sat here in my squat position, it felt comfortable. I leaned forward, oh, I stretched. I'm telling you, I was stretching for like 25 minutes before I started this. Stretch that calf out, stretch that calf out, lean on this calf, stretch it out. Thinking of spending an hour just stretching every day, you're like, that seems boring. But we do stupid stuff all the time, like sit and watch TV and our bodies are rotting, man. Play yourself a podcast, man. Just stretch. Stretch for hours. Like, your body's going to feel great. You're going to feel great. Oh, look at that stretch. Oh, you're going to feel great afterwards. So, I'm telling you, we're stretching every day with our exercises. Every day from now on. Anyway, let's do a couple of squats. We're going to try to get our back straight. We're going to use this little trick here. We're going to make sure we got a short distance between our chin and our, uh, I guess, chest there. And we're going to come up. Easy. Whew. I'm gonna do a couple of these. Oh, yeah, I feel real stretched out there. So this is no problem. And again, I wanna get it back up to doing 70 squats a day. 70 squats a day. I broke 100, guys. Go look at the old videos. I've broken 100. But we're gonna get there and we're not gonna be injured. And we're gonna do some of these slow squats. Look at this slow squat. We still got these slow squats in us. I love the slow squats. But again, I ended up getting those nagging injuries and I don't want those nagging injuries. So we're gonna focus on stretching and we're gonna increase our strength, but we're gonna do so carefully so we don't hurt ourselves. Ooh, those slow squats felt good. I think all that stretching got me all loosened up. So these squats are super healthy. Anyway guys, so keep it going. A little bit of exercise and stretching every day. Look at this slow squat. We got this man. We got our body all stretched out today. And we'll see you guys next time, right here. Daily Commitment, bye guys.